Today we will introduce the grinding and polishing machine that is used to refurbish the phone screen and back glass. Refurbishing the screen and back glass is a necessary step for refurbishing factories and pre-owned phone recycling companies. The old way to refurbish the screen is to replace the front glass, which is not only difficult but also costly. The front glass replacement will affect the price of the phone and jeopardize profits. And the back glass refurbishment is more difficult. You can refer to our old back glass refurbishment videos for details. Therefore, the emergence of the polishing and grinding machine can greatly improve the efficiency of phone refurbishment, and reduce the refurbishment cost effectively. Moreover, the operation is relatively simple. After setting the parameters, there is almost no modification. You can start the work by pressing the button directly. For the screen and back glass with small scratches, we only need 3 to 6 minutes to complete refurbishment. For the phone with bigger scratches, the refurbishment only takes 8 to 12 minutes. Furthermore, the machine can refurbish up to 4 phones at a time. In other words, a single machine can finish grinding and polishing at least 20 phones per hour. Next, we will show you how the grinding and polishing machine works and operates. The machine refurbishes the phone through grinding the scratches away. So the screen looks like a brand new screen. Then we will show you how the machine works by refurbishing two phones. First of all, let's refurbish the screen of iPhone 10. Turn off the phone. There are multiple scratches on the screen. Get the iPhone 10 mold and put the phone into it. Since the machine works with special polishing water, we must make sure that the phone is waterproof before operation. Please be noted that the phone may have water damage and faults if we fail to make it waterproof. Fill the sides and ear speaker mesh of the phone with waterproof adhesive. When applying the adhesive, be careful not to let the adhesive spill onto the screen. Otherwise the edge of the screen will be uneven after grinding. If the adhesive spills onto the screen, you can use a lint-free wipe to slowly erase. Put the phone into the UV lamp to solidify the adhesive. The machine comes with four mold plates. Two are single mold plates and the others are double mold plates. Put the phone mold face up into the mold plate. Prepare the polishing and grinding. The machine uses a water circulation system. The polishing water is brought into the machine by a pump, which can be reused. The polishing water is made of polishing powder and water. With a screen facing down, Place the mold plate in the grinding area of the machine. Turn on the machine. Set the time to 6 minutes. Press the reset button. Press the start button and the machine starts working. The grinding and polishing time is decided by the size of the scratches. But for beginners, it's hard to judge the required time according to the size of the scratch. And we advise to grind and polish the screen several times. The grinding and polishing has completed. Remove the waterproof adhesive. Take out the phone with a suction cup. The phone works fine. The scratches are successfully removed. Because the machine works by grinding the outermost layer of the screen away, the screen now doesn't have the hydrophobic effect. So we need to coat the screen with oleophobic coating.
Put the phone into the UV lamp to solidify for 30 seconds. The screen now has the hydrophobic effect. The back glass refurbishment has always been a difficulty. The current refurbishment method is to replace the rear cover directly, or replace the back glass with a laser machine. Refurbish with the polishing and grinding machine can keep the original back cover of the phone. This not only helps refurbishing factories to improve efficiency, but also helps resell refurbished phones. Then we will use the machine to remove the scratches on the back glass of iPhone 8. Turn off the phone. There are obvious scratches on the back glass. Put the phone into the phone mold. Areas that need to be waterproofed include noise cancelling microphone, rear camera, and the edge of the phone. Put the phone into the UV lamp to solidify for 10 seconds. Place the mold plate in the grinding area with the back glass facing down. Press the reset button. Start the machine. The grinding and polishing has completed. Remove the waterproof adhesive. Take out the phone with a suction cup. The phone can be turned on. The camera works fine. The scratches have been successfully removed. Since the grinding and polishing time is short, there are some scratches at the bottom. You can grind and polish again until the scratches are gone. Next, apply oleophobic coating to the back glass for a hydrophobic effect. Test the hydrophobic effect with alcohol. The hydrophobic effect returns to normal. The machine supports the refurbishment of Samsung curved screen. Take the Samsung screen assembly for example. There are multiple scratches on the top and side of the screen. Get the mold for the screen. Grind and polish for 10 minutes. We can see that scratches on the top and side of the screen are removed. The tools needed for the grinding and polishing machine are UV lamp and air compressor. The supplies needed are polishing powder, waterproof adhesive, waterproof gun, oleophobic coating, sanding blanket, glue needle, roller, and phone mold. Rayway offers a complete screen and back glass refurbishment solution, which includes all tools and supplies. To meet different needs, we also offer machines that can refurbish 2, 8, and 16 phones at the same time. If you need the grinding and polishing machine, you can contact us to learn more about the details. Thanks for watching and feel free to leave a comment.